hello guys uh, welcome to tech design in this video i will be showing you how we can use uh, trim and extend command in surface modeling so let's get started we'll go to the new file and uh, randomly i'll create one of the uh, modeling file so before i start with the trim and extend command over here and uh, before i'm starting i just wanted to create uh, some of the surfaces in order to explain you so I'll go to the surface uh, air sketcher environment and then I'll create on the surface. Click finish and I'll just extrude this comma this uh, curve. Okay. Click finish. Now I'll create one more uh, sketch. Okay, let us finish this sketch as well. Now what I'll do is I'll just extrude this as well. And this side it is 0. And this side it is, let us make it as 20. Okay. So now uh, we have an option here, uh, trim and extend. So hopefully you guys uh, got a confusion with the trim, trim sheet and as well as trim and extend. So what is the difference between trim sheet and uh, trim and extend? I'll just explain you what is trim and extend and let me know uh, we can deal with the trim sheet. So what I'll do is I'll just go to trim sheet and there are two options over here until selected and make corner. So let us go to until selected. So I want to trim this uh, sheet so my tool will be this as you can see here uh, this uh, sheet will be trimmed so if you want to change the direction you can change it over here so it will reflect as it is so click ok to trim this sheet there is one more option in this trim and extend command itself so if you go to make corner so what does it will do is yeah, as the name suggests to make corner so it will create a corner between the two surfaces either it is uh, uh, whether it is uh, in contact physical contact or if it is not in contact uh, doesn't matter it will create a, a corner as well as it will trim the sheet so let us um, see how that works I'll just this uh, surface and let us go and select this edge you can see here uh, the edge is created uh, this corner is created sorry the corner is created between the two sheets uh, how this corner is created it means like uh, for example this sheet is extended until this surface so this is what the uh, speciality in the trim and extend command uh, it will not only trim the sheet as well as it will extend the uh, required um, sheets for example if this is shorter so it will extend and uh, uh, trim the sheets so in the trim and extend command itself there is a one more uh, feature which we can see here in settings if you go combine target and tool so this will combine the target and tool this will see the target and tool so i already explained you what is the save command in my surface tutorials so if you don't know what is save command please go and check it out and now in order to check whether uh, these two surfaces are combined or not you can directly go to edge blend and you try to give the edge blend on this corner so you should always know that uh, in surface modeling in uni graphics there there are two surfaces and they should be sieved or they should be combined in order to provide an edge blend if there is no sieve or if there are two different different entities and there is an existing uh, edge or the corner you cannot able to give edge blend until and unless they are sieved or combined so i think uh, in this extend command itself we have selected combined together so let us try to give an edge blend over here as you can see here edge blend is generating so it means that um, these two surfaces are sieved properly so suppose if you want to remove it and uh, try it again so i will just remove the combined target and tool and i will try to give the edge blend now 
so if you want if you go to pick a, a corner it is not taking because these two surfaces are not in combined okay guys this is all about a trim and extend command maybe you guys got a confusion between what is the trim sheet difference between trim sheet and uh, trim and extend so let us explain that as well so in order to do that i will just uh, go to sketcher again and let us make two sketches over here mm. okay let us extrude this surface and along this sheet and extrude the same curve along the other direction so let us use the direction here okay suppose the same situation is existing over here if you want to trim this sheet uh, using a trim sheet command uh, here is a trim sheet command and this is the target and this is the sheet. so you can see here there is an error so what does this error means is uh, always in the trim sheet command uh, the two surfaces should be connected they, they should be physically connected connected each other then you can be able to make a trim sheet but in trim and extend command it doesn't matter whether the physically contact is there or not you can able to use it so for example if you want to extend this a little bit more and now try to give a trim sheet it will trim the surfaces easily so you can see here this surface is trimmed so this is what the difference between the trim sheet and the trim and extend hope you guys enjoyed this video please subscribe to my channel and hit a like button as well as share my videos thank you guys